Hi parents, how are you doing today? I wanted to talk to you about animals today and specifically what learning about different farm animals and the sounds they make can do for your young child who is learning how to speak. Um, I got these tips from Scholastic.com, so if you want to read a little bit more about it, you can go there. First of all, learning about farm animals and the sounds they, meet, they make helps teach your children about how to pronounce other words, right? If they're saying things like piggy, you're putting uh, lots of sound in the front of the mouth for the p sound for pig, and then sounds in the back of the mouth for the g sound. And so they're learning all these different ways to make sounds. So if you can say piggy, you might be able to say other words that have some of those similar forward and, and back sounds. Learning how to pronounce those sounds also then helps create building blocks for creating sentences. The more uh, phonemes that you learn, phonemes are a fancy way of saying parts of a word, like p, g, e, three different phonemes in that word, right? And so the more phonemes you learn, the more you can recombine them and, and learn different words. You can learn words that have the p sound, or a g sound, or that e sound at the end of piggy. It also gets children ready for categorizing. And you probably are noticing your children doing this already, that they are putting things in orders. They're putting round things together or big things together and small things together. And so learning more uh, words and more uh, categories of words, this is a pink pig, this is a white pig, this is a small pig, this is a big pig. It helps them learn about categorizing. This one I thought was very interesting. It prepares your children for the social skills that they need for, sk for school. You've got a small child and they don't know how to tell you when they're upset or they're frightened, right? You know, we're trying to figure these things out together, but if they can make a grrr sound like a bear or a dog, that might show that they're upset or angry, right? Or if they're going meow, 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 right? That might show that they're happy or feeling silly, right? So it helps them recognize and be able to verbalize the feelings that they have, which will help them when they go to school. Lastly, learning about farm animals teaches your children about life lessons. We're learning about, when we learn about farm animals, we're learning about how to take care of them and, and, and we show them care, we show them love. And those are things that we want your children to be able to show to each other and to you. So yes, definitely make all the animal noises that you possibly can with your children and it's gonna help them learn. All right, have a great day.